So I had an uncle uh, who was an architect. He saw my work as a as child and how I developed, and he said, Harry, you never should be an architect because you don't have any talent. <laughs> and that made me mad. So I did, was determined from that point on that I was gonna be an architect. My name's Harry Gessner. This is called the Sand Castle. It was designed for this particular site for a very much of a beautiful, wonderful woman that I was married to. I uh, promised her that I would, uh, if she would marry me on the very first night <laughs> we met, that I would design her a home. And I didn't get an answer, but I took it for a yes. So <laughs> it all worked out beautifully. I wanted to design something that was fun because I was very much in love with my wife. Well, the fireplace was designed as a stage and um, I had taken a clue from the uh, Hollywood Bowl design to reflect sound. And she would sit on this hearth and give readings and shape of the fireplace is a sound reflector and it, uh, as well as heat, because they're both waves. That was a nice surprise. You find surprises in architecture lots of times if you, uh, if you work outside the box. In particular, this house. Every day is a new day, a new life. Has something to do with the roundness, has something to do with this incredible view. What I enjoy most is the beginnings of the design. Sitting on the lot, getting all of the elements and the views and the temperature, whatever, everything to do with the environment. The inspiration comes in a rush and uh, I have to put it down on paper immediately. The house that's next door that you may get a glimpse of I designed sitting on a surfboard out there by that rock. And I drew it with a grease pencil on the board itself. And then when I got in, I, I picked up paper and uh, took my clues from that. And that's why that place looks like a wave, <laughs> because it's part of its environment. The environment is the key to my designs. And I really love nature. Any house, as long as you can see out, you have to have a view. You want perspective to your life. 